Hi guys. Long time new talk. Welcome back. Um, so this is a big week because my podcast made a comeback and let this video be known that this is also the comeback of my YouTube. Yeah, I kind of explained on my podcast, but we're back and I'm going to be posting more videos. I feel like in the fall, I always get like a surge of inspo to post a lot of YouTube videos. Um, I did it last fall and I'm feeling like I'm going to do it again this fall. So here we go. Good morning, everybody. It's 8.20 in the morning. Um, I'm feeling really good today. I woke up at 5. I just went to, well, I just got back from the gym, shower changed, ate oatmeal, drinking a protein shake which is like something I don't do, but I did it yesterday and I'm doing it again today and it tastes really good. And I'm wearing jeans today, I'm a whole new bitch. And this is the organic protein, um, it's plant-based. I really like it, I think it tastes really good, it's a vanilla one, I like it a lot. What are we doing today? Um, I'm gonna take you guys to the office with me, which is a new office which is so exciting, it's right at home, so I'll show you guys that. I am spinning at five today with Lauren, and then after that, um, you guys know Lindsay, my best friend, she just got a job at PJ Willihan's, and tonight's her first night training for a waitress, and it's wing night, so Katie, Brennan, and I are gonna go to wing night. This video is in partnership with Allo Yoga, so I wanna show you guys quickly what they gifted me for this video, and I'm gonna wear it later. They like gave me a lot of stuff, which is so nice. First thing that I want to show you guys is this bag. Literally, I've been... Oh, also, I'm not wearing eye makeup, um, just a little bit of face makeup, because I think I have like a staph infection or a sty, I don't know, on this eye. I've had it literally since July. Um, I thought it was a sunburn, and it just hasn't gone away. So if you guys know of any way for me to fix that, let me know. I've tried like witch hazel but that's not working, so if you guys know of anything, let me know. Um, okay, first is this bag, which I've been bringing this bag everywhere. I'm gonna bring it to the office with me. Literally been bringing it everywhere. It's just a giant tote. I throw it, I throw everything in here. Um, I bring it to the studio, I bring it to the gym, I bring it to literally anywhere I go. I went to Seattle this weekend and I brought it there. Um, it's just the freaking best. And they also gave me this cute water bottle. It's the BKR brand. Of water I haven't used it yet but um, so hype I see everyone use these hype about this they gifted me the throwback sock cute um, probably gonna wear these with some Air Force ones a cute hat I'm honestly probably gonna give this to my roommate because she looks so good in hats so Lauren is probably gonna wear this a ton Lauren's who I'm also spinning with at five she's my roommate She's an instructor and a studio manager at Stride. Um, you guys would know that if you listen to my podcast. So this is the, Gretchen posted a photo in this set and it was so cute. Um, so these are the high waist aloe soft flow legging um, in periwinkle heather. These are so cute. I cannot wait. I might wear these to spin tonight. Um, so cute, love the color. They're just to die for. And then I also got the matching top to go with it. And it's the Aloe Yoga um, Periwinkle Heather uh, sports bra that goes along with it. Super cute, super strappy. Um, this I, could, I would definitely wear like lounging around. I don't know if I'd wear it to spin. I think um, I would need a little more support for something like spin, but I would wear this lounging around. I would honestly just wear it as a top. Um, like if I were just to, you know, wear like leggings and this, I would totally wear this just a top. It would also be like really cute under something. Um, and I'd also of course wear it to yoga. And then I also got a little black set. So I got the high waist airbrush legging in black and I love trying new leggings. So I've never worn these before. Um, haven't tried this kind of aloe yoga legging. So I'm hyped to try these. They look super cute. These are definitely like a thicker material of leggings. So I would wear this in like the dead of winter. If I were like going to the gym, um, this would keep me really warm, um, but it wouldn't be like suffocating. So these are like the perfect pant for that. And then they also gave me a cute little aloe sports bra. Um, this is just a black aloe yoga sports bra and it just says aloe on it, super cute. 
Um, so yeah, that's everything that Aloe gifted me. Thank you again for working with me in this video. Um, I'll probably be wearing this tonight when we go to spin, but right now we are going to the office. And I keep saying the office, but it's just like the easier way to explain it. It's stride at home, but I'll show you everything that I mean. I'm gonna make a coffee to take with me and finish drinking my shake. Um, and then we'll get on over to stride at home. I feel like we have so much to talk about. So first, welcome to Stride at Home. If you guys don't know what Stride at Home is, it's the newest business of Stride. Um, so Stride at Home, is, it was born out of the pandemic. Sorry, people do that sometimes. Um, it was born out of the pandemic and pretty much Stride at Home is just Stride classes uh, available to you. So if you guys want to subscribe to Stride at Home, um, it's strideathome.com. It's $35 a month for unlimited classes. We put out about five or six videos a week. Every Monday there's brand new uploads. Um, I edit every single one, so even if you watch it, just know that I edited them. So the new ones in here with like the gray walls. Um, the black walls was done by our other editor, Mayor, who's amazing. Um, so all the gray walls I edited and then all the black walls she edited, which is really cool. But anyway, um, so yeah, you can rent a video for $5, you can buy a video for $10, or you can have unlimited access for $35 a month. I'm on there too, so if you guys ever wanted to spin with me, but you live across the country or in a different part of the world, um, just know that I'm on there and you guys can take a spin class with me. Um, but I love Stride at Home, I really think it's amazing, and in a world of learning to pivot, we had to get on board and pivot as well. So that's what we did. Let me give you a quick tour of um, the space. Welcome to Stride at Home. It's um, a work in progress. We're still moving in, um, but I love it. And I literally live here, so I'm, I love it. Um, so front door, this is where you come in. Um, you can kind of see it, but on the outside, it's, um, well, you can see it. It's the symbol of stride. Um, so that's on like the outside too, which is really cool. Um, we really did that because we are gonna be here at night and obviously as you can tell, like it's a busy street right there. So I didn't want anyone to be able to like look in. Um, you know, if we're here late, I don't want anyone to be able to look in. So we did that to kind of black it out and then I have those blinds to put down too at night. Um, and no one can see in, which is really, really nice. And we're also like a little high up off the ground, which is good. So anyway, um, candles, we always have candles burning. This is vanilla bean and maple bark. This sounds like, this smells like a boy in a pumpkin patch, which is like the best scent. Just reminds me of like, I don't know, dates and like cuffing season. Just to remind me that I don't have anyone to go on cute fall dates with, which is cool. And like everyone that comes in here says like how good it smells in here. So that's awesome. That's our filming room, which I'll take you in last. Um, I guess let's start over here. So we have, we're still moving in, um, but we have like a little coffee station um, on my second cup today. It's also National Coffee Day. So ha happy coffee day, everybody. Um, I'm on my second cup, so I probably won't have another one today, but if I ever need like a middle of the day pick me up, um, I make coffee there and I just keep like cups and coffee stuff in there. Um, it's a clock that we have to hang up. Um, speaker, random stuff. I think that's just his headphones. Oh, I was looking for this because I need this marker. This is Danielle's desk. Danielle is um, the project manager of Stride at Home. Um, she's the freaking best. You guys will meet her soon. I don't think she's coming in today, but if she is, you'll meet her. Um, so this is her husband's toolkit that we just stole from Max and never gave back yet, so thanks, Max. Cleaning supplies, this is her desk. We have to return the stuff to Lowe's, which I was supposed to do today, but it sounds like a project for on Friday, so maybe I'll do it then. Space heater, doohickey thing, punching bag. Um, it's very random in here. And then this is my desk and where I hang out. Um, Danielle are in our, um, we're having like a glow up challenge. So like this, like our board countdown of, um, we're calling it BNB, which is brand new bitch. Um, so let us live and have our moment, but that's what that board is. Um, and yeah, then this is my desk. So this is pretty much what to see. Nothing exciting, but I love it. This is where I spend all my time. And then we have a little fridge. And in here we have the, the basics, white claws, coffee creamers, and water. Um, I try and go home for lunch to like get myself out of here a couple times a day. 
um, because if not, I would just stay here all day. But I find that like I work until like, I don't know, like 12.30 or so, and then I go home, have lunch, and then I'm back here, and I feel like really refreshed every time I get back from lunch, so it feels really good. I have a work-life balance, it's amazing. I leave my laptop here, um, which is awesome. I don't, well, you can't see me, but, because I'm in the filming room. But I leave my laptop here, which is cool, so I don't bring it home. I try not to bring work home, so it's been awesome. Okay, this is the filming room. Um, so this is where we film for Stride at Home. Last week was our filming week, so it was really busy and hectic in here. I'll film our next filming week, um, but this is where we do it. So we have lights, we have a stage, that's our camera setup, that's a bike, that's a bar. Um, you know, we just have a bunch of like equipment. It's really, really cool when we do film. Um, yeah, it just looks really awesome. So yeah, I really love it here. Um, I just feel really productive here. I definitely get so much more work done. Um, and I honestly wish I got an office sooner. Um, for any entrepreneur out there, I would highly recommend to get an office, even if you like have a space. Um, like I have a brick and mortar for Stride Phoenixville, but get an office space that's outside of your business because it's amazing and I get so much done. I literally love coming here. I like, I thrive. I feel like I'm like on a nine to five grind, which I'm actually really loving, but I'm doing work for myself and work for Stride. And I'm just like, there's so much more stuff that I'm getting done. And I just see the business getting like better and better every single day. So Oh my God, I just, I love it. So I'm really, really happy. Can we talk about my hair for a second because I like said that I was gonna go darker and I am. So I talked about this in a podcast episode um, back in March um, where I was like, I like the blonde, but I don't ever feel like connected or attached to it. And I still feel that way. Um, I think this blonde color is amazing, but I don't know, I just don't really vibe with it anymore. So I am gonna go darker. My vibe inspo is still like light, but dark. Um, if you can kind of see that, I don't know if it'll focus, there you go, kind of. So I'm gonna go darker um, in two and a half weeks, maybe three weeks, I don't know. October 14th is my appointment and I literally cannot wait. Um, I just feel so like blah with my hair right now. I don't know, I'm just so over it. I've had it for so long. Um, you know, every guy I ask is like, oh my God, don't do it. But like, I want to, I really wanna get rid of the blonde. Um, I just feel like I've had it for so long. And I don't know, it's just like, I just feel like it looks so like drab and like bleh. Like the color is so good. Like this blonde is so good but I just don't vibe with it anymore. I'm just not really feeling it these days. So yeah, I'm really excited for that. I'll make a video about my whole hair little transformation thing. Anyway, um, okay, I'm gonna start getting to work. I have a lot to do today, it's very exciting. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna get to work. I have text phone, so I gotta go. Doing good. Um, I have a favor to ask of you. Okay. Are you busy today? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, I can ask D. Okay. Do you want to text Katie and see if she can do it first? Yeah. Yeah. All right, thanks, Laura. I'll be home in a little bit for lunch. Okay. All right, okay. love you, bye. Love you, bye. Um, hey, everyone. So it's um, about noon right now. So last time I talked to you was, I don't know, a couple hours ago. Um, I talked to you like 9.30 or something like that. Um, but yeah, now it's about noon. Um, so I'm probably gonna head back home and have lunch in a little bit. I'm gonna get started on um, like a little bit of a presentation that I have to put together. Typically in the morning, I'm much more creative than I am in the afternoon. So I try and structure my day to where in the morning I get in like a big flow. So I'll do like creative work in the morning and then leave like mundane tasks errands, um, editing videos, stuff like that for the afternoon because that doesn't really require a lot of like brain creativity. It's just kind of like willpower and like you just gotta do it, like grind um, as opposed to like the morning. Okay, it's about 12.30, so I'm gonna head home now. I just actually scheduled a meeting for two. Uh, that was kind of a fail by me. I didn't record at home, but I'm back. Um, all right, I gotta get started on this presentation 
I kind of want to change out of my jeans. I'm over it. It was like fun for a little bit, but like I'm very much so over the whole jean thing. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I am feeling uh, a little midday slump. So I am gonna make a cup of coffee. I got two creamers for here. I got the um, hazelnut oat creamer, which is phenomenal. Love it, highly recommend. Then I also got the um, unsweetened almond creamer that's supposed to be pumpkin spice. It sucks. It literally doesn't taste like pumpkin spice. Um, and it's honestly just like the most boring thing I've ever tasted in my life. I've been meeting at two and at three. So how about I just talk to you guys after the meeting? Cheers, everybody. So apparently it's gonna like storm. <laughs> Which I can understand because it looks pretty nasty outside if we're gonna be honest Um, okay, so I have like a couple minutes to kill before my Call I have a call at 4 15 and I'm gonna head on over to the studio and I kind of want to try on the aloe yoga stuff So I'm gonna try on um, the purple set guys Look at how cute this is. Oh my god. This is so cute. Look at this Cute little aloe set, come on now. Oh my God, it's so cute. Um, it's really comfy. The pants feel like pajama pants. Like, oh my God, it's really comfy. Um, I really love it. What do you guys think? I like the color on me a lot. Little Instagram moment. Oh, so cute. I wasn't sure if I was gonna be able to like wear the top and spin tonight. I actually might be able to. Right. Yeah, yeah for sure, that's a good idea. All right, I'm done for the day. It's 4.30. All right, office, I'll see you after the function, which is tomorrow. Hi! Is it recording? Yes! See that? It's me, I'm back. I was gonna say how annoying you are. All right, guys, it's later now, it's about nine o'clock. Um, last cup was right before, uh, sorry to get hair off my camera. Um, the last cup that you guys saw was right before I spun. Spin was so good, but like as soon as I was done spinning, I don't know, I like felt like weird and like off. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna like chill for a little bit. Um, so I just like came home and like lay down for a little bit. I don't know, I think I'm just like tired. Um, so I'm not gonna work out in the morning because I'm spinning tomorrow night too. So I'm probably just gonna sleep in to like six tomorrow, which I know it's probably like, ew, that's not sleeping in, but I don't really wake up at five. So I'm gonna just sleep in a little bit tomorrow and have like a more chill morning. Um, cause I have a lot to do tomorrow at the office. Um, but yeah, so I just like came home and chilled for like 30 minutes. And then Katie and I went to wing night at PJ Wellahan's cause it was Lindsay's first night, but the wait was an hour long. So we ended up just going to chicken and Pete's and I got a grilled chicken sandwich. So it was pretty good. Um, but yeah, now I'm home. It's 9 PM and I'm literally exhausted. So I'm going to take a shower and then I'm going to read, um we were liars which uh my uh, katie who i was just with um she read this and told me to read it and i really like it i underlined two parts of the book that i thought were like so cute oh my god this was so cute the sign says the universe was good because he was in it oh, that's so cute imagine being in love imagine there's something oh um she like one of the characters was described as strong coffee and ambition and i love that so, so far it's pretty good. Um, I'm like 100 pages in. I started it, I think Sunday night, it's Tuesday now. So um, I do like it, I think it's pretty good. Um, I read before I go to bed and I read the first, th I could do like a uh, morning routine because it's very simplified. Um, I can also do a podcast about it, but it's much more simple than like it used to be. Um, and it's working really well for me and um, I look forward to it every day, so. Yeah, anyway, um, I'm rambling on, so I'm gonna end this video. Thank you, Aloe Yoga, again, for working with me. Everything that I talked about will be linked down below. Um, and yeah, I'll talk to you guys all in my next video. Be sure to follow the podcast, Manifest with Tori Simone, and follow Stride, follow me, and yeah, love you guys. Have a great day, bye.